Alright, welcome back to this week's Sunday vlog. My name is Olin. If you haven't been here before, I live in this super small apartment in Vancouver where I make music and shoot videos like these. Um, this week, it's a silent vlog because my dumbass didn't realize that the new phone I got doesn't fit my wireless mic. So I have to go to the Apple store today to pick up an adapter as well as a case. Um, so a majority of what I already shot this week doesn't really like it has really bad audio kind of like this video right now So that's why if you're wondering like why it's more of like a silent vlog this week. So yeah I uh, hope you like it and let's go So another thing that I picked up today that I forgot to film is I got a brand new MIDI controller. I'm trying to find a better controller that works with Ableton. Um, what I'm using right now is basically meant for like a different software. So when I run it basically as like a plain MIDI controller for Ableton, um, none of the buttons light up and it's hard to keep track of where certain clips are and what's on and what's not. So this Akaya MPC Mini uh, MK2, I believe, is way more compatible with Ableton than what I'm using right now. So I'm going to try it out tonight, see if I can make it work. It's like 129 to 130 bucks. Um, and if I can like use it how I hope to use it, it's like well worth the price. Um, so yeah, let's check it out. I have like this toxic trait that when I get something new, like I never read the manual. I'm just, I just think like, oh, like I'll figure it out. Like I'll trial and error it. And um, when I was opening that uh, box for the Akaya, I didn't even like bother to grab the manual. I was like, oh, I'll just YouTube it or I'll figure it out. Like it shouldn't be too hard. 